In this video, we're going to create this propeller pin. I'm going to use a revolve feature to create it, so the sketch needs to be half of the section view. The shaft part of the pin is 0.25 in diameter and has a vertical height of 0.5, or half an inch. The head has a diameter of 0.375. I'll start a new part studio in inches. I'm going to start a sketch and place this on the front sketch plane and then right click and view normal to the sketch plane. I need to have a center line that I can use for my revolve so I'll choose line and construction. I'm going to make this coincident to the origin and vertical and now I can start drawing of the pin. Uh, I'll start coincident to the origin, draw a horizontal and a vertical line. Next I'm going to add dimensions. Uh, using my center line I know that from this side of the shaft to the center line this gives me a total width uh, and it's 0.25. Now the height of the shaft itself is 0.5. Uh, next I'm going to add the rounded head. This, for this I will use a center point arc and I'm going to project over uh, vertical coincident to the origin and project it from the end of that line. That will be the center. It goes out past so I'll just click out there and then vertical with the origin here. Now from it wants a radius. I know that the diameter is 0.375. So I'm going to put 0.375 and then slash for divided by 2. That will give me the radius. So using my line command now I will uh, connect these endpoints and also connect the endpoint back down to the origin to create this profile. And with that, I will accept it. Uh, next, I will choose Revolve and that profile. And for my Revolve axis, I'm going to use my center line that we created earlier. With that, that creates the pin itself. I'll accept that. Hit P to turn off the work planes and there's my finished part.